how to install the new Minecraft launcher from the Microsoft Store for Minecraft Java Edition, Minecraft Windows, and Minecraft Dungeons. As you can see guys, I'm currently on my desktop, and right next to my cursor, you can see the Minecraft launcher shortcut for the Minecraft Java Edition version of the game. And to the right hand side of this shortcut, you can see the shortcut for Minecraft for Windows. I own both versions of the game. Minecraft has recently released a new launcher, which encompasses all the versions of Minecraft into a single launcher. This means you can launch Minecraft Java Edition, Minecraft for Windows, and Minecraft Dungeons, which I currently do not own, all from one launcher. You may have been notified of the newly released launcher within your current launcher. So if I double click on my Minecraft launcher for the Minecraft Java Edition version of the game, to open up Minecraft, you can see at the very bottom of the Minecraft launcher, it says we will be providing ongoing support for this launcher, but there is also a new improved launcher. Download it now. And you can simply click on this hyperlink text here to be taken to the Microsoft store where you can download the new launcher. Now I'm not going to be clicking on this hyperlink text as this notification is for Minecraft Java edition players. And therefore you may not own it. You might own Minecraft for Windows or Minecraft Dungeons. So all I'm going to do now guys is close out of the old Java edition launcher here and I'm now going to show you how you can download the new universal launcher for all three versions of the game. The first thing you need to do is navigate to the bottom left hand corner of your screen to the Windows Star icon and simply left click on it. Once you've done that guys, in the pinned app section here, look for where it says Microsoft Store. As you can see guys, Microsoft Store is right here. Simply left click on it to open up the Microsoft Store. Once the Microsoft Store has opened, and if you're not currently signed into the Microsoft Store, navigate to the top right hand corner to this little icon here, which when hovered over says sign in and simply left click on it. Once you've done that guys, left click on sign in. And now enter the Microsoft account details for the account where you own Minecraft on. So I'm just going to do that now guys. Once you've signed into your Microsoft account, which you own Minecraft on, navigate to the very top here to the search box, which says search apps, games, movies, and more, and simply left click on it. Once you've done that guys, enter the following two words, Minecraft space launcher. And once you've typed that in guys, hit enter to search. For the search term Minecraft launcher at the very top, you should see Minecraft Launcher with this current logo. And as you can see, it's in the gaming section, Action Adventure, and it's by Microsoft Studios. And underneath it says, now there's a version of Minecraft Launcher, especially for Windows 10 and Windows 11. Once you've found this Minecraft Launcher, simply left click on it to open up the Minecraft Launcher's Microsoft Store page. Once you're on the Microsoft Store page for the new Minecraft Launcher, you'll see a button which says get. In my case, guys, it says install. Because it's your first First time going to be installing the new Minecraft launcher, it will say get for you. Left click on the get button and you'll now also see the install button. Before we install the new Minecraft launcher guys, I just want to read the description of what exactly the new Minecraft launcher encompasses. So as you can see it says, the Minecraft launcher is your one stop portal into the Minecraft universe. The Minecraft launcher provides access to the following games, Minecraft for Windows, Minecraft Java Edition and Minecraft Dungeons. No need to pick Pick and choose, experience the worlds of Minecraft on PC in one launcher. Again guys, this new launcher is excellent because you can launch and play three different versions of Minecraft off a single launcher. I'm just going to scroll back up to the top here and I'm simply going to left click on the install button to start the installation of the new Minecraft launcher. Once you've clicked on install, you'll be greeted with this user account control window which says, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device, host process for Windows services, and it's a verified public from Microsoft Windows. Of course guys, we're going to need to allow the Minecraft Launcher app to make changes to our device as we want to install it on our PC. So all we need to do is left click on yes. The Microsoft Store will then begin the process of downloading and installing the new three-in-one Minecraft Launcher. I'll be back with you guys once the new Minecraft Launcher has downloaded and has been installed. All right guys, I'm back. And as you can see, the new Minecraft Launcher has been successfully downloaded and installed onto our PC. I'm now going to show you how you can open the new Minecraft Launcher. Of course guys, the Microsoft Store allows you to easily click on play 
to open up the new launcher. But of course, you're not going to be launching Minecraft through the Microsoft Store each time you want to play Minecraft. So therefore, I'm going to close out of the Microsoft Store to be taken back to my desktop. And now I'm going to navigate to the bottom left hand corner of my taskbar to the magnifying glass icon and simply left click on it to open up the search box at the very top here. Type the following Xbox. Once you've done that guys, navigate to the right hand side here and left click on open to open up the Xbox app. Once the Xbox app has opened guys, maximize the window by clicking on the maximize button. Once done, the Xbox app will open. And if we look to the left hand side here, you can see the Minecraft launcher icon for the new Minecraft launcher. To create a shortcut on your desktop for the new Minecraft launcher, simply right click on this icon and then left click on create desktop shortcut. Once you've done that guys, if we minimize the Xbox app window, you can see we have a new Minecraft launcher icon, which has replaced our older version of the Minecraft launcher right here. And we can simply double click on this Minecraft launcher to launch Minecraft through this new launcher. All right, guys, I'm now going to open up the Xbox app again by navigating to my taskbar at the very bottom and left clicking on the Xbox app. Once the Xbox app has reopened, simply left click on the new Minecraft launcher to open up the Xbox app page for the new Minecraft launcher. And if we look to the left hand side, guys, there's a big green button, which says play you own this and to the right hand side here you can choose and select the minecraft edition so all i'm going to do guys is left click on this arrow here to be greeted with a drop down list of all the minecraft versions and launches for those versions of course guys i'm going to be going with the minecraft launcher which is the new minecraft launcher at the very top here so all i'm going to do is simply left click on it once done I'm just going to left click on play. The Minecraft updater will then open and begin updating your Minecraft launcher. I'll be back with you guys once the Minecraft launcher has finished updating. All right guys, once you've clicked on play, the Minecraft launcher will open underneath the Xbox app. So simply close out of the Xbox app now and underneath you can see the Minecraft launcher has opened. You have two options to log in. The first option is through your Microsoft account via a Microsoft login and the other method is through the Mojang accounts via the Mojang Jang login. I'm going to be going with the Microsoft login so all I'm going to do is left click on the first option here. Once done you'll be greeted with your Xbox Live account and your profile picture along with your username. At the very bottom you have the option to switch your account or simply play by left clicking on let's play. So that's exactly what I'm going to do guys. I'm going to left click on let's play and this will automatically log you in using your Microsoft account that you've also logged in with using the Microsoft store and the Xbox app. As you can see, the new Minecraft launcher has opened. And if we look to the top left hand corner here, you can see there's three different versions of the game which you can select from. The first one which we are currently on is the Minecraft Java edition version of the game. The one underneath is the Minecraft for Windows. So if I simply left click on this you can see I also now have the option to play Minecraft for Windows through the same launcher as the Minecraft Java edition launcher which you couldn't do with the older launcher and lastly the third version of the game is Minecraft Dungeons so if I simply left click on this you also have the option to play Minecraft Dungeons through this launcher however I do not currently own Minecraft Dungeons this new launcher is excellent it's a three-in-one launcher allowing you to play and launch any version of Minecraft that you own to test out this launcher guys I'm simply going to left click on Minecraft Java Edition as that's the version that I want to play today and then I'm going to left click on play Minecraft Java Edition will then begin launching and I'll be back with you once I'm on the Minecraft Java Edition home screen. All right guys, as you can see, the new Minecraft launcher has successfully launched the Minecraft Java Edition version of the game. I'm now going to exit out of the Minecraft launcher by left clicking on quick game to be taken back to my desktop. Once done, I'm going to reopen the Minecraft launcher by double clicking on the new Minecraft launcher shortcut icon on my desktop here. Once the new Minecraft launcher has opened, I'm now going to launch Minecraft for Windows version of Minecraft. So all I'm going to do is navigate to the left hand side here and left click on Minecraft for Windows. Windows. Once done, I'm just going to simply left click on play to launch Minecraft for Windows from the same launcher that I just launched the Minecraft Java edition version of the game. Of course, guys, I do not own Minecraft Dungeons and therefore I'll not be able to launch it for demonstration purposes off the same launcher also. But the process for launching Minecraft Dungeons is exactly the same. And as you can see, guys, Minecraft for Windows has been successfully launched off the same launcher. 
All right, guys, that pretty much concludes the video on how to install the new Minecraft launcher from the Microsoft Store for Minecraft Java Edition, Minecraft for Windows, and Minecraft Dungeons. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Why is it so